I gotta do it, man. Unibody designs have become increasingly common over the years and most of the cars that we see today have just that. But what made unibody designs the default choice for passenger vehicles? Let's understand. Number 1. Cost and Scale Our unibody design involves more complex manufacturing processes. So a factory that makes these requires much more tooling and hence a much higher investment up front. However, as the production begins at scale, the cost per vehicle drops down significantly. A unibody design thus saves money for the car maker in the long run while also requiring lesser materials. Number 2. Weight and Emissions Unlike body on frame designs that are heavy and bulky, unibody frames are lighter. So how does that help? A reduction in weight is like hitting a jackpot because not only does it increase fuel economy which automatically means that more people will be buying that car but it also helps with emissions like cafe norms that aim to reduce CO2 emissions by reducing the overall fuel consumption. A lighter weight also allows the suspension setup to work more precisely and more predictably. Number 3. Safety One of the things that unibody cars are almost always better at is safety. The large impact that results from a very sudden deceleration is better managed by these cars, primarily due to the presence of tumble zones that absorb a huge portion of the impact energy, keeping the occupants inside safe. The crumple zones also minimize impact on pedestrian or any structure that gets hit.